team configuration allow a small group of users to work together, sharing some aspects of the system as a group, and then having some of their own individual settings. A team can be as small as two in the case of a close partnership, or it can be as large as 15 team members or even more. You can configure your team many different ways to give each team member individual rights and individual access. For example, a team of two might be set up like this. Here, they will share all of the contacts and both will have full access to all aspects of the system. Or you may work in an office where you are all on the same team. In this example, you would all share and work on the same contacts. Or maybe you have an office where each team member has their own contacts and works their own deals. For those of you with a complex team structure, you can create a team with each team member having unique access to the system, some having their own database while others share their database with other team members. Here's a quick overview of the team member levels. The account owner is the team leader and has full control of all aspects of the system and of the team. The account owner owns their entire database and pays for the monthly subscription. There is only one account owner on the team. The system administrator can do everything the account owner can except cancel the system subscription or change any of the subscription billing options. Administrators share the account owner's contacts and deals. There can be multiple administrators on a team. A team player has limited access to the system and shares contacts and deals with the team leader. The team player will not have a lot of flexibility to change system settings. Independent users also have limited access to the system, but this team member has their own contacts and deals. Finally, the power user manages their own contacts and deals and has their own advanced system templates. A power user can even manage other team members, where this mini-team will all work the same contacts and deals. Contacts can be reassigned from one database sharing group to another. Team members can share their email and letter templates with the rest of the team. Tasks or to-dos can be assigned to different team members, and the best part is that the account owner or team leader has full control to see what each team member is up to. You can start as a single user and build your team at any time. To start building your team, log into the system, go to Settings, then Account Settings, then Team Settings. This is where you will add and configure each team member.